Today we're taking a closer look at our two immensely popular Overlander bags right after this. Now, ever since our Overlander bag was released to the ADV market during the spring of 2020, it immediately became a bestseller. Not only does it have a universal fit and can be installed on any motorcycle with a luggage rack, but it also keeps your belongings dry and dust-free no matter how harsh the going gets. The Overlander is made from the extremely durable material Hypalon, which is the same material we use for our motorbikes. It has high frequency welded seams and YKK AquaGuard zippers for its external pockets to ensure your belongings stay dry and dust free at all times. The Overlander comes with a stiffening innerboard, which gives it its semi-rigid properties. Not only will it hold its shape when it's completely empty, but also remain tightly fitted to your motorcycle at all times. The roll closure has a four layer design. Two layers consist of the actual bag and the two additional layers are made from transparent TPU. This ensures a 100% waterproof and gasproof seal, and this is why we also equip the Overlander with a valve to facilitate the closing of the bag. The Overlander comes in two sizes, 30 liters, which is 7.9 gallons, and 48 liters, which is 12.7 gallons. Included with each bag is a detachable beaver tail, an inner board, four main straps, two longer straps, four extra buckles you can use to customize your attachment points, and two padded backpack straps. And if we take a closer look at the beaver tail, we can see that it has two sides. One side is a molly panel where you can attach smaller bags, and the other one has a detachable and transparent pocket. It attaches to the Overlander with four quick lock buckles. And if you're a photographer like me, this is the perfect place to store your tripod. The beaver tail is also where you store the separately sold hydration bladder. To install it, simply open the zipper, slide the hydration bladder into the beaver tail, clip it, and pull out the hose through the top center hole. The Overlander is one of our most modular bags, as it can be used as a top case, as a luggage expander for your panniers, and as a backpack. Thanks to its many attachment points, smaller bags like our micro bags or bottle holders can be installed more or less anywhere on it. This way, you can customize your setup so that it fits your needs perfectly. If we take a look inside the Overlander, we'll find three internal mesh pockets which can be used to store your smallest essentials so they won't get lost among your other items. The inner lining is made red on purpose to increase light reflection so that you more easily can find what you're looking for. There are basically two ways to close the Overlander. The first and easiest way is to simply fold the roll top once, like this. Close the side buckles. And lock the backpack straps under the center strap. And finally close the beaver tail with the two remaining buckles. Now this is how I ride 90% of the time, as long as it's not super dusty or super rainy. But let's say it's super rainy outside. The way you want to close the Overlander is the way it's designed to. First, start by stretching the top like this, and then gently roll the roll closure, open the valve, and squeeze the air out. And then once the bag is fully deflated, just close the valve, close the side buckles, again lock the backpack straps under the center strap, and finally, secure the beaver tail. Now it doesn't matter how much it's raining or how dusty it is, if you're riding in a desert or in the worst kind of rain, nothing will get inside your Overlander. Mm -hmm. 
The Overlander can be attached to any luggage rack with the four adjustable straps, each equipped with a quick-release side buckle. You can choose to mount it across your rack or in alignment with the bike, depending on your personal preference. Two longer straps are also included and can be used to securing a tent or a drive bag in front of the Overlander instead of having to use separate straps. And if you want to lock your Overlander to your bike, you can use security straps from Steelcore. Keep in mind that these straps are neither included nor sold by us, so if you'd like to purchase one, click the link down in the description. To install the Steelcore security strap, start by feeding it through the luggage rack. Then install your Overlander as usual. and feed the steel core strap through the aluminum bracket at the top. Lastly, lock the steel core strap and stow away the access webbing. And to easily carry your Overlander, there are two heavy-duty handles on each side. And to convert it to a backpack, simply undo two of the side buckles for the beaver tail, swing it around, lock it in the very same buckles, undo the center strap, thread it underneath the backpack straps, click it in, and there you have it. And if you know that you never will use the Overlander as a backpack, you can simply remove the backpack straps by unclipping in the bottom. And in the top. And that's it for me guys. If you want to know more about our Overlander bag and also order one, the link to its product page is down below. I hope you liked this video. Consider subscribing to our channel if you want to see more content like this. Until next time, ride safe.